Welcome back to Black Side Sports. And tonight we're going to talk about Brett Favre says transgender athletes should not be allowed to compete in Olympics as women. Brett Favre is standing up. We even saw Caitlyn Jenner stand up and other athletes stand up against these so-called women, transgender, trying to be women and participate in women's sports. This should be an outrage with all women's groups. Where is now? Where's all these groups that support women's rights? How the hell can a woman compete with a man? Now they're gonna say their testosterone levels are low, but she's still a he, she a he, still has the bone mass of a man. So how are you going to compete with transgenders? We have seen this in high school track where you had three transgenders in the Connecticut State Championship run against all females and they smoked all of them. This is when you know not only is this cancel culture, this transgender culture, and all these different cultures they make up every other month. It's destroying the balance of nature. A young lady who trains all her life, high school, college, to have that one moment to go to the Olympics, and you may be the best, you may not be, but you get a chance to compete and you're beaten by a transgender and they receive the gold medal. How the hell would you feel? See, this is going to boomerang against the LGBTQ community because maybe there should be a separate category just for transgenders. But for girls who don't have that body mass, who don't have those muscles, how in weightlifting do you compete with a man? The world is upside down, and it seems like nobody is listening. Everybody is afraid to say the right thing, but we do have athletes stepping out, and there should be more athletes because you have daughters too, and they compete in sports too. What if you got to the state championship and you were the best in the state as a woman, but you were beaten by a transgender? When you look back on your life and say that was my state championship, when you look back and regret that someone didn't stand up for you and that gold medal could have been around your neck, this is how far this nonsense is gone. When right is wrong, and now wrong is right. This is the society they are trying to give us. What you see in front of your eyes is not true with them. So now we have this man who's now a transgender woman competing with women. I bet you the majority of women in this weightlifting category disagree with this but they're scared to talk about it because of the backlash in this so-called progressive social justice warrior culture. I want to thank you for listening to Black Side Sports. I hope you subscribe to this channel, smash that like button, but also share this video.